Hey guys, today we're going to replace this old, ugly, outdated um, light fixture with a modern LED light fixture. Should be pretty simple. With the power off, simply remove all the glass covers and light bulbs and start unscrewing the light fixture. It's actually going to rotate and we should be able to loosen it right up. Okay. And now with the wires exposed, we simply unscrew all the electrical caps. Alright, time for the new hardware. So this model has the mounting plate with a center threaded screw. Pretty simple. Simply thread in the provided screws. Okay, next I'm gonna wrap the house's ground wire around the ground screw, and then it's gonna continue to the light fixture. So we'll leave it partially exposed. Okay, the ground is nice and tight and we still have enough exposed to go to the light fixture. So when you install these light fixtures, they come with the manufacturer's provided electrical caps. These are the thinnest, cheapest caps I've ever seen. Um, I swear the manufacturers make them for like a penny each. Um, if you've ever done a light fixture, you'll find this is where it gets difficult and a lot of new DIYers are intimidated because you almost need four hands. You're trying to hold the light fixture and not drop it, while at the same time you're trying to twist the wires and get them connected. Um, let me show you a better method. These Wago connectors, wire connectors, are highly engineered. They make your life a lot easier. So in this method, we're literally just going to open the levers. They're rated for stranded and braided sol and st solid wires. You simply install the wire all the way in. You can see at the back that it's installed all the way in. And when you lock that lever down, they are firm and they're not going anywhere. So the next ground wire is, is for the light fixture. Fasten it on down. And look at that. It's actually held its own weight. I'm completely let go now. And I can get the other wire connectors and keep working. So go ahead and purchase the Wago wire connectors. Currently, at the time of filming in this video, Menards carry them in store nationwide. You can also order them online. It's worth picking up an assortment of them and having them in your toolbox. Okay, the hot or black wire from the house. And that connects, of course, to the black side of the light fixture. After you lock them down, you can also look inside to make sure they're seated all the way down. And the white neutral wire from the house side. Lock it down, and the white neutral wire for the new light fixture, and lock it down. Okay, next you're going to want to fold up these wire connectors into the work box, the electrical box. And then with the wires tucked up there nicely, the new light fixture will be uh, installed right with the center threaded provided and then there's a nut that holds it okay at this point if you want to check your wiring connections go ahead and turn the power back on and you can check the electric before you put the glass shade in place all is good we'll put the glass shade back in place If you don't have enough thread there, you simply remove the glass and you can lower that. The glass shade, decorative cover plate, and the nut to hold it all in place. Okay, there you go. Beautiful new LED. It's a slim line, so it takes up less space than the old traditional. Um, looks good, works good. The manufacturer states they can work for up to 10 years and they are very low energy consumption. I bet you can do it yourself. 